In this lesson, we will assess the submitted work as teacher and close the workshop activity to reveal grades. On the course main page, navigate to the third week of the course and click on Proposal for Project Activity to open it. To turn on the Grade Evaluation phase, click on the bulb icon on the Grade Evaluation column and then click Continue. Once you have enabled the Grading Evaluation phase, click on Calculate Submission Grades. Under Grade Evaluation Settings, select Fair under Comparison of Assessments and then click Recalculate Grades. These are the actual grades for submission and assessments, calculated as per the comparison criteria. By changing the parameter for comparison of the assessment, you can recalculate grades with some degree of leniency or strictness. You can also override the grades by clicking on any grade and manipulating it manually. Click on the grades for student 1's submission. This is the work submitted by student 1. Scroll down to reveal assessment form. Under Assessment Settings, you can edit the assessment weight and also override the grade for assessment. Change the grades for the submission to 9. Enter the feedback and click Save and Close. Grades for Student 1 have changed but final grade for submission is still 11. In order to change it we have to recalculate the grades. Similarly, you can try this on other grades in the table. Navigate to the top of the page. Now, in order to let grades appear in the grade book, simply close the workshop. To close the workshop, click on the bulb icon under Closed column and click Continue. As you can see, the activity is closed and all grades are freezed now. Scroll down and expand Course Administration under Settings block and then click on Grades to view the overall grades. Hold the horizontal sidebar and drag it to extreme right to reveal grades for workshop activity. The highlighted area shows the grades for submission and assessment of the workshop activity. Now, open your Moodle site in your computer and implement the exercise before proceeding to the next video.